All right, guys. So I've been back testing this strategy and it's going well. Apparently, you can see I made my entries at the crossing of the green line on the main chart. I'm going to explain how to set this up. But this is the first condition you are to look out for. Please, um, I don't, I don't know how to raise my voice louder than this. I just hope I'm audible, not not strong. But I'm still, I'm still gonna make this video for you guys, so that you uh, maximize this strategy to your own benefits, right? To your own advantage. I need you guys to pay close attention. Okay, pay close attention. Now, the video is not going to be very long. I'm going to be as brief as possible. But you can see that there was an entry made at this region after the crossing of um, the green line. The price pushed um, above the green line on our main chart before I made that entry. In, before I made that entry. Ideally, the entry should have been made immediately after the crossing here. But obviously, I did not see it. I did not see I did not uh, meet the market at the time, at the time of this crossing, at the time of this crossing, right here, right here, okay, but then having seen that every other condition has been met, I still made my entry and as you can see we are push pushing upwards, um, there was a big a bit of spike, spikes, um a bit of spikes but market still eventually um went back up okay so i'm going to be leaving the market as soon as as soon as um these indicators here get to the level 90 of the adx and the bollinger bands get to the level 90 of the adx level here that's when I'll be leaving the market. Please pay close attention. <clears throat> Excuse me. Please pay close attention. Okay. Um, now, this is the crash market. This is crash 500. This is crash 500. I gave a signal on this um, some time ago. Using the same strategy. I gave my, my VIP members... A signal and it went well and today again i'm here right still trading using the same strategy and it's still going well still going well you can join our um telegram group our free telegram group to see more good results to motivate you to know that you can't give up you can't um you can't quit just because you had bad experiences the market consistency pays off trust me guys so just join in there's another spike right there but it's not it's nothing to worry about of course i've already taken out some um gains i've taken some positions out before now so i'm just leaving this to make this video to show you guys that this is possible so i'm still hoping for it to still push up anyway even if it spikes back into my entry i don't care Okay, I've already taken out a lot of profits using this strategy. And I'm sure it's still going to push upwards. As long as this guy, there was another movement from this, from the indicators here. Until he gets to this region, then I will not be really bothered about whatever spike is happening right now. So, um, how do we arrive at setting up this strategy, these indicators, right? Let's just go straight to that first before I explain further the um, the uh, usage, right? Before we go into before I go into explaining how to use it, let's just see the setup, okay? So we have the moving average on our main chart. We have the average directional movement index. On once you add this, it will create. An indicator window for you we have the Bollinger Bands these are indicators that help you detect the trend the alligator and then 
Yeah, that's that. So for the moving average on, on our main window, this is the setup period 10, shift 0, method linear weighted. If you click that, you'll see a couple of options. You just choose the last. Apply to weighted close. You see a couple of options. You click the last. And then for visualization, you can see I'm using color green. This is a white background chart. So follow my colors if you are using the white background. But if you are using the dark background, you can switch and just um, use colors that will be visible on the chart. So you click done and you have your moving average on the main chart, just like what I have here. All right, just like what I have here. Okay, the moving average, the green line running on the main chart. Running across the chart is the moving average. So we go to the next... Um, indicator which is the average directional movement index when you add this like i said it's going to create an indicator window for you so if you've not um had that already don't worry just add this indicator it will automatically just create that window for you so the levels are 90 and 10 all right this is um what one would occur over bot region where people where there is um likely to be selling pressure in the markets and this is where market is likely to witness more of buying pressure so you can label that if you want the color you can see the color i'm using if you're using dark color then you, you need to change to you need to switch to um bright color so you click down you're done with that and then nothing else should be changed around here you can see all of these are just the same color as the background of my chart all right so click done when you're done with that and you have your um ADX on the indicator window you can see the black the black lines on the on the um indicator window right these black lines the level 90 the level 10 right level 9c and the level 10 okay now what else what else what else the next one is going to be the Bollinger bands with the following parameters period 5 shift 0 deviations 0 0.100 apply to typical price you can see a whole lot of options you just choose typical price levels are not needed so you don't need to add anything there and then for the visualization you can see please this should be this should be on all time frames and um styling use the color as i'm using right use the same colors i'm using or if you are using the dark background you can just switch to bright colors right but make sure you are following um with the same color so that you, you will not be well you can use whatever color you want of course but make sure it is visible in your chart if you follow my colors it will be easier to understand my explanation okay click done when you're done with that and the next one would be the alligator all right just period 13 teeth period eight lips period eight just shift five teeth shift five lips shift three method exponential click that you see a couple of options choose exponential apply to median price to see a lot of options choose median price and then the visualization or time frames for the styling please ensure to just change the lips alone Every other one should follow the same color as the background of your chart. You can see I'm using white colors because my background is white. So um, for the lips alone, that's why you change the color because you want to see the line, right? You click done and you have it. All right, you have it on your chart. The, the two lines here, you see the blue guy, the other guy, these are what the only things you should see on your indicator window. All right, so now that you have this, remember I said the first condition I had to look out for was on the main chart where price had crossed the green line, the moving average on our main chart, and then that's a sign that the market is going upwards. Now, this is for the crash market, please. This is for the crash market. All right, I would have made this video using the boom market, but I did not really see good, um, I did not see good setups. That means the indicator did not really show me anything. 
of course, I also like to analyze the market with my naked eyes without these indicators. And I still did really, nothing really showed up, so I just had to leave. It's not every time that you take a trade. You just leave the market that is not showing you obvious um, setup. Okay, so now you need to also see that price has come to the oversold region before you think of buying the crash market. By that, I mean price had come to level 10. You can see price was already at level 10 and then crossed each other at level 10 and started pushing upwards. All right, you can see started pushing upwards before this crazy push towards the upside. Remember, I, I um, labeled this place the buy region. This is where um, there is likely to be more of selling, sorry, buying pressure in the market. This is where there is likely to be more of buying pressure in the market. So whatever happens around this region, around this region, all right, they are looking to buy. They are looking for a buying opportunity. It's not enough to just buy because price has come to that region, okay? It's not enough to buy because price has come to that region. There are other things to still look out for that might still help you um, have a more confident um, trading setup or a more confident uh, opportunity, a more confident entry. One of those is um, I like to go to the higher time frame and look at the candlesticks when price, when my indicators have actually come to these regions, I've shown all of this. My indicators have proven that these things are ready, right? The confirmations that I need, I have seen. I like to go to higher time frame to see the candlesticks at the higher time frames, right? So here, price was ranging a bit. You can see price was ranging around here. But if you observe, you see that there is more of bullish momentum around that region, right? So while price was ranging around this region, while price was ranging around this region, there were more, there were more, um, more uh what is it called rejections from buyers there were more rejections from the buyers than the sellers you can see it's just this um very rejection that i've seen from the seller and probably these two but from the buyers you can see this you can see this you can see this this you can see this very one which is what would have prompted my entry this very one all right the only reason why this didn't prompt my entry is because I did not see a crossing of price at the lower time frame, right? Press, um, crossing of that green line, my moving average line in the lower time frame. All right, so the next indicator, oh, sorry, the next um, candlestick, which happens to be this guy, this guy in the middle here. I'm just going to have to clear all of this out so I can really show you guys what I'm explaining. Uh, I need to take all of this out. Let's take all of this out. Okay. So, having seen this bullish momentum, you can see after this very strong bullish candlestick, market still printed a, a, an engulfing candlestick. You can see this is bullish candlestick. Even still printed another bullish engulfing candlestick here. So, you can see clearly that price was showing more of the bullish momentum that is the confirmation that makes more sense to me than most of the indicators setups right this confirmation has given me um a more uh has given me more confidence that the the um indicators are doing well okay i don't really like to depend on indicators um independently because I mean, I don't, I don't depend solely on indicators because indicators are designed to just follow price. Indicators are just following price to show you what price is doing. All right. That means price can actually move faster than indicators sometimes. It happens. All right. It happens that just like you are pursuing somebody, you are chasing somebody and the person is running for its life or something like that, right? The person at the time might run faster than you. Because the person is trying to survive, 
right? The person doesn't know why you are chasing them. So they tend to want to escape. So if indicator is following price, then price sometimes might run faster. Get that. That is why I urge everybody to understand how to analyze the market without these indicators, okay? I teach my students to analyze without indicators. So please um, reach out if you must join our training. It's very affordable. Um, my WhatsApp number would be my WhatsApp number would be in the description box of this video. Our free Telegram group too will be in the description box of this video. So make sure you join us, guys. Um, also drop your feedback. I've seen a very very fine feedback of my previous. Uh, my previous strategy and i shared it to the telegram group to motivate others because a lot of people are making that guy said he's making a thousand dollars a thousand dollars almost every day using the strategy i posted so this thing is work right if you check on my free telegram you'll see that testimony is right there all right it's right there it works you just have to sit your butts down and do the grind okay do the work but most um, importantly, learn to analyze the market without the indicators, learn price action, learn to read the candlestick patterns, learn to study um, chart patterns, learn to be able to, as a matter of fact, learn to have um, a framework which you base your analysis on. That's what I teach my students and um, some of them, a lot of them are profitable right now. They do well for themselves. Some of them even dash me money <laughs> on a daily basis, guys. I'm not even kidding. So, I'll see you guys in the next video.